Welcome to Woggle Guides. In this guide, I'll show you how to remove some of the new features that were added in the latest Gmail update. Let's get straight into it. I'm logged into Google and I'm in my Gmail inbox. When the new design for Gmail was first launched, there was an option shown to users that allowed you to return to the original Gmail view. This was only shown for a few months, however, and is no longer available as an option. You can still, however, make a few changes in the settings of Gmail that remove some of the main visual differences that were introduced in the last update. Let's do that now. I've already opened the Quick Settings section of Gmail by clicking on the cog or gear icon at the top right of the Gmail inbox. I want to go into the Details settings of Gmail, however, so I'm going to click on the See All Settings button at the top of the panel. A new window then opens, showing a number of heading tabs, but the one we're interested in is Chat and Meet. Let's click on that once to open it. A new page is then shown, and you'll see it contains options on how to show the Chat and Meet sections for Gmail that have been added. Removing these sections is quick to do. I'll start by moving my mouse down to the Chat section. At the moment, Google Chat is switched on, but I want to switch that off, so I'll click once on the Off option below it. I want to make one further change on this page before I save it, however. If I move down to the last section of the page, the Meet section is shown. As before, I want to hide the Meet section in the main menu, and I can do that by simply clicking once on the Hide option. Once this has been done, to confirm those changes, I need to click on the Save Changes button at the bottom of the page. The Gmail inbox will then reload, and you'll see that the new panel that was added in the recent update has been removed. If you ever want to add either the Chat or Meet sections back into your Gmail inbox view, check out the Gmail guide shown above that explains how to do this. I hope you find this Woggle guide useful and learned something new. If you have, please like or subscribe for free so that you can find out when new guides are available. Thanks for watching, and do look after yourself until next time.